Good morning, good morning, good morning, and now this is a throwback Thursday recipe out of a very old cookbook, and this will also be part of the 1896 Fanny Farmer recipes that me, I mean, Susan at Hillbilly Chicken Ranch and I, Louie's Kitchen, are doing. So, let's turn the camera around. Let me show you. Oh, and before I forget, that coffee is a brewing to eat with our, with our muffins. Uh, so, let me turn the camera around. And let me show you. I know, I know. I forgot to introduce myself. My name is Lou Ann, and welcome to my kitchen. Uh, and I know the recipe, the corn muffin mess recipe is not really breakfast. Um, that we're going to have like it with goulash. So, but I thought I'd include it in this video. So, let's move on. So, this recipe has one cup of flour, one cup of cornmeal, a uh, fourth teaspoon, half teaspoon of salt, four teaspoons of um, baking powder. Now, I need to mix this all up. It says to sift it. I'm not sifting it. This same as sifting. And I do have my um, muffin pan ready. If you ain't using paper liners, then you need to grease, um, heavily grease your muffin pan and preheat your oven to 400. I got mine at 350, maybe move it up to 375. The recipe says to slowly, gradually put in a cup of milk and we will be using two tablespoons of shortening as well um, in our corn muffins. And I did... Uh, take a photo of both recipes. Um, there is a one that adds um, this is not the correct spoon to do this y'all. Add one beaten egg to this as well. I need to melt my shortening that I'm going to I'm gonna add butter. Uh, I need to melt that and we will be adding that to this and then we will put in it uh, put in it three-fourths full in our muffin pan here. The second recipe out of the let's see American Woman cookbook that I'm doing is waffles, but I'm not gonna make waffles. I'm gonna make pancakes with it. Uh, we got a cup and a half of flour, half a teaspoon of salt, three teaspoons of baking powder. So I'm going to mix this all up. Like I said, I'm going to make pancakes with this instead of waffles. Um, so I know the corn muffins that I made yesterday, there was no sugar in it. I'm used to having sugar, but that is what they made way back when. They didn't put sugar in their cornbread. So got this all mixed up and now I need to get a cup of milk, two eggs, and a tablespoon of melted shortening. I'm going to use butter. Uh, so I'm going to get my milk and I'll be right back. Like the muffins, it says to gradually add the milk. So I'm adding the milk gradually. So get this stirred up. And then I will be adding the eggs after I add the milk. So I'm going to use the same measuring cup. So there is our milk. I add the eggs here in a minute. Let me get the eggs, get this all mixed up, and then we'll add our beaten eggs because I'm gonna beat the eggs a little bit before I add it in here. So hold on. Like I said, I'm making uh, pancakes instead of waffles because um, usually most waffle mix you can also use to make pancakes so I'm using a smaller pan it's only me um, and the noise in the background I'm doing a little canning um, finishing the canning that I started yesterday so now I'm waiting for all the bubbles along this the side and in the middle to come up before I flip and I did spray this with some 
no oil. I know I probably should have put butter on there, but I didn't. So I'm going to wait for that, and then we'll flip it over, and then we'll have pancakes this morning for breakfast.